Today in this video I'm going to talk to you about solvent welding PVC and particularly I'm going to talk about what happens when you over prime using for using primer when you over prime a PVC pipe when you're gluing it together we say glue it's solvent welding but when you do that and you, and you use too much this is kind of what happens let me show you something so we had a leak right here and uh, just dug this up and this is what happened this pipe was setting in right here and it had flooded this entire area over here this pipe ran right here this actually is an RPZ that runs to the building they added this later and so when they dug all this up our irrigation lines were already run right through here I wish they would have just moved this over but they put it right here that's fine well I think what happened was when they filled this back in dirt got packed on this pipe and it ended up cracking it and it cracked it right at this bell end here but what i want to show you is well let me turn it this way you can barely you see we use purple primer here and it's part of our texas state law but you can see that that primer has gone all the way almost all the way through that pvc which you want it to penetrate but you don't really want it to penetrate that much and you can see a little bit in here see how the primer went past the bell end and the glue did as well now I actually was the one that did this and so this is a good example to show you but it's a good example for me to see this and know that I need to uh, you know really pay attention to what I'm doing what you want to do is on these bell ends and any kind of fitting you only want to prime where this part is going to go in and see I actually went past it a little bit so what happened was it weakened all of this part of the PVC so then when they put dirt on it and pushed it down it was it you know since this was weakened it cracked right there had I not done that you know they still might have broke this but it might have been less likely to have broke had I not over primed it got past the part where the prime needs to be and didn't use too much so let me go ahead and open this all the way up and you can see you see that primer that's leaked down in there the glue as well the solvent weld and you can really see how much that primer went through that pipe and it was on this part that was sitting like that so it pulled right here and that's one of the things that happened is it, it actually weakened this to make it more prone to be breaking than it would have otherwise so when you are solvent welding one of the things you want to make sure you don't do is you don't over prime you don't use too much primer or you 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 take it way down the pipe or you let that primer pool and fittings or end in the pipe it's one of the things you want to pay attention to and make sure you don't do because it is a thing over priming is an actual thing that you can do and you want to be sure you do not do that and so you just pay attention to what you do you need to use primer and you need to use enough to where it does penetrate the pipe because that's what gives you that good solid weld to your two pieces of PVC when you're using your solvent weld stuff but you don't want to use too much so be careful of that and if you do be careful of that and you don't over prime your stuff's gonna last a long time and you won't end up in a situation like I am today. Kelly Staggs here, American Irrigator, trying to make you a better irrigator. Consider hitting that subscribe button and hitting that bell and give us a thumbs up if you like what you see. 